As a lesbian who once depended on a man for money, I'm having a lot of thoughts this Pride Month. Three years ago, I was walking right here in this very spot talking to my spiritual coach crying because I knew what I needed to do and I was afraid to do it. I was afraid to leave a man that I financially depended on and worked for to come out of the closet. And right there on that little patch of grass, I was walking and I saw a feather and a hundred dollar bill. Now, hundred dollars can't get you very far these days, right? But it was my sign from God because she literally said, look around, God is going to provide. You've got to be authentic. You've got to live your truth. And um, I looked down and that was there. And to this day, I keep that feather on my vision board as a reminder of God's promise to always provide and how God's done more than provide. And I just want to encourage you today, if you haven't come out or you know someone who hasn't come out, uh, if it helps to share my story, share it. Because I think if I could have seen someone else do it, who was also worried financially, who was also in the South, who was also worried about people thinking something um, based on religion, if I could have seen more of that, maybe I would have been braver sooner. So encourage people. Pride Month is so important because there's people out there who are considering unaliving themselves rather than living their truth. Pride Month is important because people out there feel like the people who they need to love them, their core family, their core friends, may not accept them. Pride Month is important because we need to show the world that if you don't accept and love, not just accept, not just tolerate, but love people, you will be on the wrong side of history and your grandchildren will be embarrassed of you.